Welcome back YouTube, I haven't done an update in a while regarding my Verona cabinet humidor so I thought I'd just uh, go ahead and make a new update video regarding what I got in here so let's uh, take a look inside here and uh, I just, you'll notice that I have two glasses of distilled water here a bowl and a glass I'm just trying to regulate my humidity uh, to keep it a little above 65 let me just close that door there. So the first box I grabbed was a box of Manowar uh, Bellicosos from uh, CheapHumidors.com. Great prices. I actually really like the smoke. Uh, beautiful packaging, as you can tell. Um, you have the little sigil underneath there. And as you can see there, if the camera focuses, it says Bellicoso. So that's uh, the Man of War Bellicosos. And then some of the stuff you've seen before, some of it's new. We got some Prensado Toros and um, some Prensado Churchills and then uh, over here we have some of the Alec Bradley Tempest Maduro Imperator size let me just open it up here it's uh, the Maduros as you see there and they're the torpedo shape and then these are some of my babies here these are La Flor de la Antilas in Toro 20 in a box I haven't opened up this box yet I have a few singles uh, which we'll see soon and then I have a, let me just put this away here. And then you see a Cohiba Siglo there. I just have a single there. I haven't put them away yet. A few others. This is a barrel of pipe tobacco. My own blend I put in here. It used to be a cigar container. You got some chubs. Little Alec Bradley's down there. And that right there. Let me just put this barrel here. Right here we got some Gurkhas. Uh, Park Avenue Maduro. Uh, they're in uh, torpedo shape. And then we got some Alec Bradley, uh, which ones are these? I think these are the American Sun Grown, yep, blend. And then we got uh, La Roma de Cuba and some My Father number ones. We'll see some of the individuals of those. So here are my specials, Alec Bradley Black Market Hooligans here. I have uh, quite a few of them there and some Prensado uh, Robustos. Uh, the Hooligans are actually pretty good. Uh, we got some Alec Bradley Tempest Maduro Imperators and some SCRs, uh, which I believe are no longer in production. And uh, they're decent, they're decent, they're pretty good. Uh, we got some more of the Flor de la Antilas in Toro. And uh, we got some Rocky Patel 1990 uh, Vintage, as you can see there. Let's move on to the next drawer. I got, these are my My Father number ones here. Uh, great, they're not the Maduro ones. And up here, let me just move the door. We got the Romeo uh, from Romeo and Julieta. Uh, these were, I think, a third on the Cigar Aficionado and some short Churchills there. I gotta fix that band later. Let's move on to the next one here. We got uh, some Carlos Torano's Exodus here, the big boys. We got some Rocky Patel, The Edge, not the Maduro. Rocky Patel Old World Reserve, which are really good, and some Fonseca Series Fs, which are really good. Next drawer, we got some of my favorites here. These are the Cuban uh, Hoyo de Monterey Epicure Number no. Two, a beautiful creamy smoke, delicious. Next drawer, we got some Monte Cristos here. Some Padrones down there. As you can see here, that says Monte Cristo. It won't focus properly. We got uh, some Padrones here. Some Padrones at the back. You can't really see. Uh, we got some La Aurora's here. Um, I can't remember which ones those ones are. But these are um, the Bellicoso shaped. I can't remember what line they're from. It doesn't say on the band, unfortunately. Down here are my Cubans. Uh, so I got um, Sigalo number... Uh, six, some Robustos, and I got Robustos, a couple boxes of Robustos in the back. Monte Cristo and Mundo, um, the Cohiba Maduros, and some Cohiba Esplendidos. I don't really smoke Cubans very much, uh, but I have a lot of uh, my friends who do, so I always keep uh, a bunch down there. And that's uh, basically my humidor review. i uh, put that back there. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, guys, keep on reading.